Hey, what's up dudes, and welcome to Gamers and Milkshakes. I've actually been playing uh, this game for a while now. pick a pick a pow And it's pretty fun. Sunless Sea is a pretty challenging game, actually. I've died quite a few times now, and it's kind of annoying. But, you know, hey, that's just the name of the game when you're playing on a Sunless Sea. So, I'm actually going to do some stuff. I don't know what I uh, just played yesterday, but looks like I need to pick up a strategic information of the avid horizon so I'll make my way up there I like to uh, stick to a certain course I'm actually getting a little too far out oh god gonna gain the terror oh I'm scared but um, so this game is challenging I've tried to fight sharks a few times even with my 73 iron and mirrors up to 58, they still slaughter me, which is really annoying, because I would think with 73 iron, oh, I should be able to put on the hurt. Guess not. So, either way, I'm going to make my way up to Avid Horizon. There are certain courses I like to try to do, because in Sunless Sea, if you don't make naval charts, like uh, certain ways that you're going to travel you're going to gain too much terror and thus your crew which is one way that i died will have well they will do mutiny if that's the right thing to say but they'll uh they'll kill you and that's no good because then it's end game and nobody likes to have an end game you feel me oh yes something awaits me in the port i think i found out that earlier when i would go to london and I didn't have anything awaiting me in the port, I wouldn't have my terror reduced. But when you do have something waiting in the port for you, your terror will reduce. So keep that in mind. If, if you have something in the port, that's the best time to go home, because then your terror will go down to 50. Thus, your oh no. No, not the nightmare. Oh, fuck. Um, I'm just gonna try and flee. I failed. Excellent. Gain 24 fucking terror. Oh my god. Rip me open. Now my terror is so high. <sighs> Gain another 5. What am I doing? Now I've 80. This is bullshit. I'm telling you, man. Terror is a pain in my ass during this game. And I just, I can't find ways to flip in, like, get around it. Like, I try my best to um, stay on good courses, so I don't, oh, I don't know. It's just really frustrating that no matter what I do, I find myself still gaining a ton of terror, and my ship end up getting screwed in the butt because of it. So, oh well, what are you going to do? I guess that's just the main thing in this game, is that you're just going to gain terror, no matter what. <laughs> gonna go crazy, baby. So it's just gonna have to be that way. But they're still working at Kinks Out since this is an early access game on Steam. Uh, so I guess it's just something you're gonna have to deal with. Two vast wing shapes guard a gate. Something like resin. Smooth but uneven. It is deep gant. The color that remains when all other colors have been eaten. Okay, great. I'm going to retrieve my uh, strategic information. I'm not going to worry about reading it. And I'm going to gather my intelligence and just get home. Because the way that this is going, I would normally go and get port reports from these places. Uh, but right now, it's definitely not worth it because of my terror is so high. And if I have another one of those nightmares hit me, I'm probably going to die. No. I don't. Nope. Not dealing with it. Error. God, this sucks so much, man. Like, I, I'm really trying my best to, like, give to uh, 1,200 um, Echoes so that I can buy a elegant townhouse and a will. So if I die, I can pass on my stuff. But I don't even know if I'll make it to that point. So I very well, very well could be just screwed either way and lose everything that I have. Because I've been busting my butt at this game, but it's so hard to gain money. Uh, I'm just kind of screwed no matter what. I guess that's just how the game is uh, designed to be, is just to screw you no matter what. But maybe I'll find a better way to play this down the road. My terror is unbelievably high right now, oh my god, 88. 
This is just awful. I'm going to try and make it a beeline straight to the light. I'll probably gain one tear before I even make it. Or I won't. Perfect. Go a little bit slower so I make sure I lose that tear. Excellent. I'm going to probably gain two tear trying to get to Codex. Which sucks too. But what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Nothing. Exactly. Can't do anything about it. You're screwed, man. Game over, man. No way we're going to live, man. We need more fuel to the, uh, fuel to my ship. Psych, I got enough. I just need a little mutton. A little mutton, me lord. Alright, engine temperature's good. Hunger's good. Great, still gaining terror, even though I'm right by the shore. Excellent. Let's just get out of this hellhole. This is garbage. I'm garbage at this game. No, uh, I'm, I, I like to think I'm pretty decent at this game. Oh, and I found a good way to manage fuel is you turn off your light and you still gain terror but right before you gain it boom just turn it back on especially if you're next to the shoreline or even lights it'll still go down if you're in the light for the most part I think so that's a good way to uh, manage your fuel at least I found it to be a good way to do it and I don't know if I should take on these lifebergs I really don't feel like finding out until I have a will I've heard that they're a good way to farm to make echoes because uh, they drop good loot, but I have no idea, and I don't want to risk it, because if I risk it, I could lose everything, man. Everything. I don't want to lose everything. Oh, oh, oh. Alright, so I'm just going to try and make my way back to London before I gain all my terror and I die, but knowing this game, it could very well just kill me right now, and... I mean, I guess that's fine by me, but it would be really annoying, you know? It's like sometimes you just want to be able to live. Just live, man. Just have peace and harmony, man. So there I am. Oh god, the bats. The bats are coming. I actually like to farm them for supplies. Because they're a good source of food, but I, I just really need to get to Fall in London. And they are fast as shit. Like, I thought my boat was fast. No, these, these bats. Those bats are the fat. Oh, no. More bats. More bats coming my way, Captain. All right, put more fuel. Put more fuel in the engine. Oh, God. They're gaining on us. Oh, God. Lord, have mercy on my soul. They're actually pretty stinking fast. I'm glad shark They're going to catch up to us, aren't they? No, a questioning tentacle. I lost one crew. The Z is quiet. Nothing stirs, but you saw the moon pale limb of the monster. What? Oh, Jesus. What was it? The flipping kraken taking my guys? Oh, my God. You know, my terror wasn't high enough, but now I got the kraken coming after my guys. That's excellent. Just when you thought everything was fine, it's not. It's not. But uh, I was actually uh, at Hunter's Keep, and it ends up finding out that the place just burns down, and the maid is like on the ceiling with glowing yellow eyes, and it, and she's like saying something about Zaylers, and she hisses at you when you try to capture her, and it's really freaky. But the whole place burns down, and his sisters die, and you tell the uh, admiral about it. What the fuck? Really? I'm just fucking losing crewmen up the ass. What the fuck is this? I don't know, but it's getting really annoying. I'm telling you, man, this game surely is just out to fuck you. Like, you will never be able to succeed in this game. Besides, well, you will. You'll take like two steps forward and then three steps back. So, you feel like you're making progress, but you're not. I'm almost there. There's still something in the port, so I'll be able to uh, breathe a sign of relief. But look at that, nightmare strength is at 11. My nightmares are kicking my ass. So now that I'm here, I'm just going to get a restful night and whatnot. And go and just turn in my cash and hopefully make it to the next day. But anyways, this is just a short little video. And I hope you guys have a good day. Make sure to leave a comment. Like and subscribe if you like my videos. I'll be posting more stuff. Alright, till next time, guys. Have a good one.